C'est là qu'on va juger demain ici en avril ouais. Demain, c'est le grand jour. Hein? Ah oui, c'est le, le grand jour. Et puis, on a entendu beaucoup de temps. Je travaillais un peu sur cette histoire depuis plusieurs années. J'ai travaillé sur cette histoire depuis plusieurs années, mais je ne pouvais pas trouver la bonne approche. Je ne voulais pas simplement simply to collect witness reports like that without putting them into perspective. And the arrest of Hussein Habri opened the door for me. I found an approach to write the screenplay and could go on then to structure the story of the different witnesses and make the film. Clément Abayfoutas is the president of the Association of Victims of the, of the, of the, of the, the of Victims of the Hussein Habre regime. He was a facilitator, a mediator. He put me into contact with the different victims. Clément was really the one who tried to make sure that the victims went towards the light, was trying to find some kind of reconciliation and find the right words. Can you forgive? It's very tricky to forgive, but if the executioners ask for forgiveness, can you remain indifferent to that? <laughs> And that's what he tries to do, to get all three on the same bench, but you'll note that Clément does not shake his hand. I showed the film in Chad, there was a premiere screening on the 6th of May, and it was extremely moving. After the screening, the mood was very serious and grave. There was a cocktail reception with nibbles to eat, but nobody wanted to eat anything. They just congratulated me, there were tears, and then they went away as if after seeing such a film, it was out of the question to have a drink. They perhaps went off to reflect and think of the dead, because there were 40,000 dead in eight years. That's what was left as our heritage. Mm. I'm optimistic because the facts that have been evoked and the testimonials that have been produced are so condemning. I think that this will be an exemplary verdict and I hope that this will call to order all of these African presidents because sadly in Africa there are so many dictators and people who have massacred to reach power. Can is uh, unique. You hear, you listen to everyone and the whole world will hear your voice. It's really important no matter how much space you were given in Cannes. I think the fact that your voice will be heard is so important. I'm thrilled to be here and I'm thrilled that the voices of these victims will be heard by thousands of people. <laughs>